Jason is in Tampa, Florida. Hey, Jason, welcome to the show. How can I help? Hey, thanks for having me, Dave. Sure. What's up? Hey, uh, quick question. I had a, uh, I had two back surgeries in the last uh, year. Ouch! What happened? And I'm unable to uh, perform my my job, so mm-hmm. I have to find a new a new profession. Well, what happened to your back? So, um, I had uh, a her- herniated disc. And you heard uh, it at work, or? The- well, I heard of it at home, and then I was working, and it kind of got worse from work, and then had the first surgery, yeah, fixed okay. it 100%, How old went are back you? to work, and within two weeks, re-injured myself on the job. Oh, man. How old are you? So we uh, so went to court, or didn't go to court, got a lawyer, um, settled, and my wife is is working mm-hmm. full time, so I'm like Mr. Mom mm-hmm. for the past I don't know year and a half or so. Um, so we have a pretty good amount in savings okay, now. Stop, before stop I actually a second. stop a second. How old are you? Yeah, um, I'll, I'll be 45 this year. And what did you used to do? Uh, installed security systems. And what do you? Um, how much settlement did you get? Uh, close to 40. Thousand dollars, yeah. And your your wife makes what? Uh, she makes about fifty four a year. And you guys have been draining down the savings during this year and a half. No, no. no you've, you've, lived mean, on, you've lived on her fifty four. I, I was and getting I was getting uh, workers uh, workers comp. Oh, okay. And she she actually does a uh, does a side job. Yeah. And she when does your workers comp run out? Oh, it's gone. It's out. Okay, so what is your new career going to be? Um, right now, I'm looking for something in the uh, customer service field. Okay, how did you choose that? Um, just something that's not going to be so physical demanding on my body. Right. And I have right. I have years of customer service, like 20 years. Oh, okay. That's Over nice. 20 years. of. So. There's a lot of things that wouldn't be tough on your body that aren't, aren't customer service, but if you've got a background in that then you could move into that field. Okay, good. Okay, so what what's your plan then? So, well, my uh, my plan is obviously to, to get a job, you know, mm-hmm. ASAP. Mm-hmm. Um, but before all this happened, I went out and I got a, I got a truck. Now, mm-hmm. I have I have $25,000 on the truck. Um, I have no other vehicle. My wife just has her vehicle. Mm-hmm. Do I pay the truck off and just be done with it? If you don't get a job making forty thousand in the next month, you sell the truck and get a different okay. vehicle because your truck's way too expensive for this situation. It's absurd, and I don't want you using the settlement money to pay off a truck you really can't afford anyway. Um, if you if you if the settlement money hadn't come along, you'd be screwed on this truck. Mm-hmm. And if you don't get a job now, if you get a job and your household income is ninety and you have a twenty five thousand dollar truck, then yeah, pay off the truck. Reduce your settlement money by that much and work your baby steps. But let's get you in, in a position in your career first so that we can say this truck doesn't look stupid anymore. Because you didn't know it when you bought it, what was all always going to happen. I understand that. But where you're sitting today with a $46,000 income and Mr. Mom has a $25,000 truck doesn't work. Right. That doesn't work. But we're not going forward with that plan anyway. So let's... You know, let's not panic and dump the truck today. But, no, I wouldn't pay it off today because you may be selling it. Uh, but I would get a job as soon as possible. Or like, give yourself 30 days. Go to KenColeman.com. Start listening to Ken's podcast on careers. And I'm going to send you a copy of his book next week when it comes out on the 13th. It comes out in seven days. And uh, it's called The Proximity Principle. And also at his website are downloadable PDFs on the interview process and on the resume process. And you need to download both of those and read them. They're not very long, and they're very, very informative when you're in the heat of a job hunt. But you need to, you need to identify some places that you want to go to work, and you need to get in the business of going to work there. Um, you've been through awful, painful stuff. Back pain is one of the worst things out there, and I'm so sorry you're facing that. But you're 45 years old. you got 50 years to do something. So let's get about the business of doing that something. you got kids to feed and a truck to decide whether we're keeping or not. So you might as well take a bow. That chapter is closed. That act of the play is closed. We're going to come back out and do act two, and that's where you are. And Act 2 is everything that happens to you wonderfully 
after back surgery. And that's what's on your agenda. You got it, man. You can do this.